Governor Bianoku said that the committee set up by state governments to address cattle rearers and farmers' clashes will sort out unresolved issues by paying for damaged crops and urge them to avoid confrontation. Governor Bianoku also announced a lift of suspension on the three members of the state House of Assembly suspended from the party during the recent misunderstanding in the Assembly, including Messrs. Harford Oseke, Ikem Uzeze, and Victor Koye, noting that lifting the ban is important because the period is critical for unity to ensure ensure a resounding victory at the forthcoming polls, adding that a vote for APGA is a vote for democracy dividends. <laughs> The national chairman of Abgachi, Victor Ye, called on Ndibo to identify and align with the party as it has prospects for promoting better life. Our presidential candidate of one of the two parties in America. He may be the one as a governor, who oh, in the first term, we in the second term, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, the one as a man. Yet he's still working as a governor to third term. Oh, but you know, I run there with passion. The Commissioner for Works, Engineer Marcel Ifejo, for in his remarks, said that billions of Naira have been expended on road projects in the area, notwithstanding its difficult terrain, while the Commissioner for Local Government and Shiftency Matters, Mr. Greg Obi, who highlighted projects executed through the Governor's Community Choose of Projects Initiative, said that it is a way of ensuring delivery of dividends to the grassroots. <laughs> In signature two of His Excellency, Ifod Anaba Weche Cheputa, seen as the best way to see touch in the life of Indian man in all the remote areas in Anambra State, Bo Na Emesia, each community, Eche Ife the Fanga, Kalo Olofa. Also speaking, the Transition Committee Chairman for Anambra East and West, Mrs. Pius Ifade and Sylvester Okafo, while appreciating the Governor for his interventions, especially during the recent flooding in the area, added that Heather's menace is increasingly becoming difficult, promising to deliver the party during the elections. Some stakeholders and frontline candidates in the areas, including Chief Chinedu Emeka, Chief Chinedu Obidigwe, Mr. Obin Emenaka, among others, assured that the party is on ground and on course for victory. The Governor was accompanied by his wife, Chief Mrs. Ebele Chukobiano, party faithful, candidates and stakeholders from the area, while the party flags were handed over to the candidates vying for different elective positions in the area.